welcome back to our very last video of 2023 now we couldn't leave you without hopping on and saying a very merry christmas and all the best for 2024 from everybody here at the small holding now yesterday we opened up a few presents ourselves it's boxing day today so we thought we'd quickly show you what we've got the animals for christmas as well Stephen can't wait for this one <laughs> Right then, girlies, you first. Now, I'm super pleased to say that Hazel, who's on the camera at the moment, has settled in really well, and her and Apple are getting on fantastically. Oh, Hazel is very food-driven, as you can see. So let's have a look what we've got. Hers are better. Yeah. Here. 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 Two happy goats. Let's see what the horses have got. What or what could it be? I can't believe I'm opening presents for horses. <laughs> Here you go then, girl. Here. What's this for you? you? Make your breath smell nice, garlic. Oh, what's this? <laughs> what's that? What's that? Yeah. Go put it in there for you so it doesn't go all over the place. There you go. There you go. That's it. That's all it is. Yep. Oh, he's loving that. So good. <laughs> his eyes are popping out of his head. You're gonna try it, Stephen? Hell no. <laughs> it's Time to see what the chickens have got. Now to do that, we're coming outside because they are all outside. A little bit of a precarious walk on the way. Right, chicks. Here you go, chicklets. Oh, see what Santa's brought you. Oh, cool. Do some of these on my cereal. <laughs> Sunflower seeds. Sunflower seeds. Just, just a few. As you know. What else? Got some. Meal worms. Yumski, yumski. Put out the bag. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Come on. Let them have it, we need to move. Try this. What's going on, Larry? I'm gonna go boys with Mum. Oh, now I think these guys might have a bit of a clue as to what they've got for Christmas. So these are our chicks that um, we got in the end of August. These guys were born, weren't they? They're looking really well, coming on really strongly. Now we separated them off with this fence just so they didn't get picked on by the by these guys here. But they've come on really well. Big 
next up, the ducks. Let's go see. I think some quackers. Oh, quackers! These guys have also got some mealworms. We're just going to float them in the water because at the end of the day, ducks prefer doing everything in water. So the chicks have had all the Christmas presents, so we just thought we'd show you how far on they've come since the end of August. So they're about four months old at the minute. And this is a this is one of our row down red cockerels. I think we end up with three or four cockerels, didn't we? Out of twelve, and we picked three what we thought were cockerel welsomers and nine girls, and it actually turned out we got the we got it right. We got three cockerels and nine girls. If you can just see through the door, that's one of our welsomer cockerels. There who's coming on a treat. He's getting all his colours and all his plumage. This one, a bit of an ugly duckling still at the minute, but I'm sure he'll come into his own when he starts getting a bit older. So we'll just let him down and let him enjoy the, the coconut fat balls and everything we've got him. There you go. <laughs> right, we're just gonna finish off with the sheep, give him a little Christmas treat of a slice of bread each. They don't normally get anything else but grass or hay, so it's just a little treat once a year. Come on then, how are you out the way? How are you, Dorby? He doesn't know what to do with it. Nettle's just hoovering them all up. Here, <laughs> Carol. Look, it's moved back. <laughs> right, well, that's it for 2023. We'll see you all in 2024 for some big projects and also some little projects. So thank you to everyone who supported us and watched us over the year, and we'll see you next year.